Um, I'm I'm liking the pants. The pants choice of the dancers here. I'm liking the. <laughs> it's on fire. <laughs> What's up, peeps? I'm Chicken, and this is who are you? I'm Cat. Fantastic, and welcome to one of our new segments that's called Chicken and Cat React. And basically, we're gonna look at some stuff, mainly music videos, a few other things here and there. And uh, we're just gonna give our reactions to it. It's a fun little thing for us. Sometimes we'll do like personality quizzes. I don't know, fun, funny stuff here and there. But we're gonna be getting into a music video. What, what uh, do you got me getting into today? Something I've never seen. Which, to be quite honest, I'm. I'm gonna put my mind down for this. Is I'm a little concerned because I don't know what you were doing in 2000, but I sure as hell was watching the. Britney Spears VMA performance of Oops, I Did It Again, and I Can't Get No Satisfaction cover from the Rolling Stones. Um, this is a very important performance to not only my life, but um, any Britney Spears fan. I'd say in 2000, I was probably listening uh -huh. to like Nirvana or Soundgarden sure. or like Alice in Chains, Same. System of a Down early stuff. That, that's probably that was like my scene, really. What I'm getting at, though, is like this was such a big effing deal such a big deal at the time because everyone thought she was naked and like super scandalo and I mean you can go on TikTok and see worse but it just really it was just one of those iconic moments of not only Britney Spears but just the amazing in general and I'm really shocked that you've never you've never seen like even the still of this like this is like nothing to you I, I mean I'm sure I've seen some kind of bits and pieces somewhere of this before but I don't like not all the way through you know and, oh, this is Chicken Junior, by the way. This is a little, little pup, Chicken Junior. But anyway, yeah, let's let's jump into it. I'm I'm curious to see what you're getting me into here. Iconic. I know you're like a huge you're gonna love it. You're a huge Britney Promise. stan over here. You I'm know, I'm here for you. If you want to talk about it? You can DM me directly. Watching, uh, you know, listen to podcasts all the time. Britney Spears. And I can recommend at least three different Britney Spears podcasts. Leading, need it. leading meetings at work with Britney Spears related stuff. I mean, this is just, you know, I can go on and on about your, your fandom in this regard here, but let's just get I'm into so this. Let's just check you. it out. I want to know how you uh, let's check how it out. feel about this. Can I see All right, what do we it? got here? Okay, I'm going to look at this, a turn. It's rotating. It's pretty interesting. It's an interesting little uh, intro. Look at her what? outfit. Look. What's going on with that? Oh no, she's going stones. She's going stones. Also, can we talk about the era where pop stars wore sneakers and it just it just really helped out their dance performances? Just peep her sneakers. It's iconic. I love it. Ugh. It's like a sequin and suit. Mind you, she's 19. Like, what were you doing at 19? Not this. I don't even know. Her pants look like they're coming off her. Oh, she turned it away. Everyone's, I'm guessing by this point, just throwing a fit. I'm gonna go ahead and pause it here. I'm guessing everyone's just like, is in pause here by the way okay. just like oh. the riot the riot that ensued if you are of a certain age you remember how ridiculous this outfit was and everyone was like oh my god how could she how po she naked scandalous she's literally she's literally in a bra a halter top bra that is nude and pants that are nude like pants they're pants you see worse so again. it's just like hey look at me i'm nude yeah and like people threw such a fit about it and i'm like you got why? Because she has a great body? Because she's powerful? Because she's amazing? I don't know, man. I don't know what's going on with it. You know how, like, the, uh, it's like, you know, moral America, the moral right here, they're going to get into this, you're like, oh, this is like a strip tease. No, it, it was you a know? different time. I mean, <laughs> we definitely were not where we're at now. Um... I mean, That's I wish I had those abs, so... I remember... That's... Do you... You don't remember watching... You know the diary series on MTV, like, this is the diary of Britney Spears. She specifically said that she used to do 500 sit-ups a day, and I remember as a 10-year-old 
doing 500 sit-ups a day or like attempting to because I wanted I wanted How to be her <laughs> <laughs> like a hundred which is great for I mean for me that's great and like a 10 year old but it was just such a dramatic moment the tabloids were like oh my god can you believe watch this half naked girl I'm like she's not naked she's not she's really she's not, not naked not naked but like that reveal though I mean I mean, it's pretty close to as naked as you could be while being on TV. It's that. literally. It's but I mean, do the pants come off or do they stay on? Is the thing. <laughs> if the pants go off, then we're in a different conversation it's for that. Just but watch. if they stay on, you, okay, you've never seen that. This is. Like, I mean, I don't really care either way. But <laughs> I mean, I, don't, I meant like I don't care like what she's doing about like wardrobe either way. No, I'm saying I'm you've at. never seen like this outfit of Britney Spears. Like this is the iconic nude outfit i can't say that it's in my memory because i don't know like i didn't pay a lot of special attention to this anyway let's get back to the video oh it just goes right into it huh a mashup if you want me to perform the dance for you? I don't know, man. Maybe later. Maybe later. Look at her. 19. What were you doing at 19? All right, yeah, let's pause it here. Um, I, I'm liking the pants. The pants choice of the dancers here. I'm liking the... <laughs> it's on fire. It's fire. It's literally fire. <laughs> okay, I've never, I've never paused this video, but, like, this guy... Oh, this guy's into it. That guy is into it. He looks like he's, like, 50. He Look looks 50, face. but, I mean, he also looks like he may be performing some kind of ritual to the dance guy. His gods. arm is, like, out here. I mean, I I love it. I love it's what, just a, what God is he sacrificing to to get that flexibility? Stop. I'll sacrifice anything for something. That's that's pretty great. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe he does kind of have like a grayish tone in this stop with the light, like kind of just that harsh light it's, coming in here. It's so iconic, two thousands, right? Like just the what are? I, I, I mean, my brother had that hair at some point. To the of the guy to her left on our right here, or the way we're looking at it here with that just like puffy. He got he got even more hair than that in the early two thousands like that. So I love it. It's just so nostalgic. <laughs> it's so good. Oh my god. I yeah. But I I mean I had to pause it just I mean, we gotta appreciate the pants. Those are those are pretty epic. <laughs> Alright. Um let's check it out. Let's see how this goes. Now, wait, so I wanna pause it with the, the dance move really quick with the oops that she just did what now when when i study music appreciation we look over all these things i taught it a little bit i took a music one class. what i'm saying is they, they talk about this concept called like word painting when you do that with like music and you do that with like how the music itself forms and stuff right and i'm sure that like that happens in like interpretive dance and all these other kinds of things like as a dance form and i'm wondering where in the lyrics it translates to that the little leg kick thing she just did as being oops that's pretty interesting what does it matter what is it it's matter? pretty cool what it's pretty it i mean like oh, let's just rewind her. it really cool let's just she rewind has a it glitter really cool. thong on let's I rewind it i want to know like this right here this is the oops as it translates in dance it's can pretty you kick cool that high? can you kick i'm that not high? i'm just saying this is cool this is oops ready oops it's not <laughs> i like it it matches it it's just like you know like, oh i felt oops god i just and her crimped hair <sighs> not that innocent they're holding their crotches i want to use that in among us like, I'm going to pause her, and I'm just going to be like, I'm not that innocent. <laughs> See what happens. I like that, like, what is that, guitar? This version of the song is different from her original, mind you. I can tell. I mean, I've heard it enough to know. Uh -huh. 
It's all right. So I, I actually do like the kind of remix going on here. What is that... like the background with the? It's like kind of heavy in the guitar. Yeah, a little the bit. guitar specifically. I remember when this came out. I was like, I need this version, and I could not find it. Pretty sure I got it off Limewire. No, there was yeah. a there was a band out there that was it was some kind of metal band. They did a cover of this song, and I don't know. Like I just it's like bringing me back to that <laughs> a little bit. I'm, for, I'm forgetting who it was that did that too. It's a band that I've definitely heard before. I don't know. I listen to it's Britney Spears and Britney Spears. So. It's a cover. I don't know. Okay. Like, I know August Burns Red did Baby One More Time, but... Okay, but riddle me this. Are you impressed so far? That was, like, a super famous band, too. <laughs> are you impressed so far with this performance? Um, it's, it's a spectacle. And, again, I appreciate the pants. It's not... And... I mean, there's some there's some guitar. It's a little heavier, and there's that thing that's also metal. So like, there's something metal about yeah, it, you know. I don't know what that metal egg necessarily is relevant to, but yeah, I, mean, I don't know. I mean, whatever. the the vibes, the kind of choreography, it gives me you know that Romstein angle vibe a little bit, and the strip club a little bit, you know, just kind of darker and stuff. That's pretty cool. I feel like that's a stretch. I no, 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 no. I'm saying it has to appeal to that part of me, that memory. Oh, sure. Because, I mean, okay. you're listening to Britney, it's all about nostalgia for you. Yes. Right? Uh -huh. So I'm thinking of my nostalgia now. It's like, oh, looking back on Romstein, man. I oh, love okay. That. So it's, it takes me to that place. You sure. Know? That kind of dark, grungy. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, where they come from? Dance. Just wait. They dancing with towels. Stop. That's pretty cool. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You're ruining this experience for me. I mean, I imagine to get that gig, you had to have like some like, uh, what is it like, color guard experience in some way. It's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, I get it. Liking Legend. that guitar at the end, too. That's pretty cool. Icon. I mean, they pretty, just... Pretty cool at the end. That's a that's an interesting remix. It was a little... It was a heavier remix. They just more don't do it like this anymore. They just don't. They just don't. In, in what way? In that way. They like, you just said, like, you mean, like, the genre or, like, the, the overall performance in that way? Just the energy, just the pure athleticism. I mean, they had that whole, like, dance career phase that came yeah, after this right now, career. right? Like, it was, uh, all, like, the Jabberwockies and all that, guys, you know, they came okay, after that. Okay, we started on the Jabberwockies. If you ever go to Universal Studios and watch the Jabberwockies, you will be disappointed. What? It's awful. You can talk to Freeze about it. Yeah. Two out of ten experience. Don't do it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so get some hate on the Jabberwockies in a moment. I need that particular performance. Whatever. But you're not impressed? I mean, that was a that was a show there. That was, that was quite the show. I was impressed with the pants. I enjoyed the pants. I like the remix version of that, I would say. It's got a kind of, like, just... It's got that sexy, like, grungier feel to it, you know? I, I like that, the remix version of the song. You don't like it. Huh? You don't like it? I was saying I like the it's remix so version good. of the song. It's so good! I, I guess I can't expect everyone to have my enthusiasm. I said I like the remix version of the song. I like the, the performance and the dance. Like, imagine being in that audience. Ugh. I, you wish you were in the audience? I wish I was you, in the audience. You wish you were in the audience? Is that what we're getting Everyone knows. <laughs> everyone knows. There's a little chunk here in the audience. Yeah, well, if you had to guys. like rate it, like was what? that like gonna be like a uh, probably not on the level that like the Beatles mania that these girls were feeling? I mean, that got out of control, but people fainting. No, it's just crap. iconic pop legend of the era. Like this was it. This was huge. It was massive. 
this was like the zenith of her career well not necessarily like the peak of her career but like this was that really like huge tipping point for her like i know she was popular when this album came out and everything but like i thought that the, even the album that came after she was like at least one or two of the albums that came after she was still pretty popular britney or in the zone do you want to do a whole another compilation i was saying in the zone i think later yeah i know that i was saying that she was still pretty popular around that time She's it wasn't still like a giant now. peak i know hashtag free britney you were saying it was like the peak of the career i mean everyone's gonna peak at 19 or 20 come on that's just who we are dude i peaked in eighth grade don't talk to me about it <laughs> come on but yeah overall pretty cool dude pretty cool again love the pants her pants no no, fire, no, no. Pants. fire pants fire pants gotta get me some fire pants love it chicken walking around fire pants can you imagine I need, like hard alcohol for that statement it's just <laughs> i don't know i this is everything to me because it's so nostalgic and i remember watching this specifically and being like my brain just exploded and now for looking sure. back <laughs> it's 20 years 2000 2020 20 years math wow wow <laughs> it's almost like it was exactly 2000 the year please leave me alone <laughs> <laughs> all right but yeah, anyway, if you liked our React vid, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and leave your comments below. Do you, do you have the same experience as Kat here? Were you one of the Britney stands back in the day that uh, got to watch this performance live and just lost your mind? I don't know. Um, may have been like me watching Soundgarden and, you know, System of a Doubt at the time. Who knows? But yeah, anyway, thanks for checking this out, and uh, we'll see you next time, peeps.